Well, a very good morning to all you smileys. It's the 16th of uh, August, uh, 2023, and I'm uh, once again, as I was yesterday, at Wellingborough train station. Now, um, it's the car train day today, and uh, unfortunately, it is at the or was when I left home, what, 10 minutes ago, it was running about 40 minutes early and that bothers me now uh, normally it used to come into platform 4 which is over there and um, we would film it and then we'd get the next passenger train which went down the line that I'm looking at here and it, I would overtake it at Bedford because Bedford is very congested and um, it, they hold up the car train there so when you go past the north junction of Bedford, you film the train again. And then you get off your train at Bedford and uh, you film it again going through to Bletchley. Uh, however, now the train that I'm going to get on, hopefully, <coughs> comes into platform four. But today it's coming into platform three. And the car train instead of coming into platform four, is coming into platform two. So um, let's just play along with it and see what happens. And thank you for coming with me. Well, a nice little double unit. That either come from uh, Nottingham or from Sheffield. Uh, that one for sure has come from Nottingham and coming down on platform 4 at any minute will be the uh, local train from Corby going to London St Pancras. Hopefully the car train will come down there and then we shall wait on this platform for the train which is one of these which will stop at Bedford we hope. Just keep smiling and stay with Smile Video and you'll be okay. Never ending. Um, that's normally full of cars. Um, I'm lost for words now, I don't know. So we'll go down to Bedford just for the ride, okay? Well, I never thought to put my camera on, just had a nice chat with that fella. Um, he came down especially to see the car train. <laughs> There's no cars on it. I don't know why there's no cars on it, I've never seen it go through empty but apparently there are now two car trains according to my big son David um, so, but I'm still going down to um, Bedford just for the ride and um, whatever happens happens, I should just come back home and have a nice afternoon with a glass of whiskey I think that's what I did when I got back from Leicester yesterday I was absolutely shattered 
Went straight and had a double whiskey and I felt all right then. <laughs> okay, nice talking to you, smileys. Okay, we've been sent over now back to platform four. And uh, this is the train that we normally catch when we go down to um, Bedford and London and that way. And that's the fella that I tell you I, I didn't um, didn't get on the yeah later. okay um, I didn't get on the film but I've got him on now and he's just had a look at small video trains that's good isn't it <laughs> so here we are now on the London train which was planned from platform three so we've now come over to platform four and we're still going to Bedford and we'll, it's curiosity whether we'll actually see the car train without any cars on parked up outside Bedford waiting for the station to clear. Okay. Okay, normally by now we've crossed over to the fast line and overtake the car train on this slow line. So um, this is going to be very, very interesting to see what goes on. Okay. Don't know why, this is um, the old station of Urchester that they're on about opening again, but then again, I don't think it'll ever happen in my lifetime. This is the second time in my life, that's 86 years, that I've come through this freight tunnel and we are going much slower than what we would normally go down the fast line which does not go through the tunnel. So, um, hey, hey, what's going on? Um, coming out in a minute I'm sure it's interesting isn't it quite a long time this tunnel was built before the main line was um, uh, I'm sure I'm correct no I'm not I'm not correct I don't know for, I've forgotten in my old age, but um, I think these freight lines, oh no, the passenger lines were built and it went over the summit of the hills we've just come through. Then they added two freight lines and um, because of the steam trains struggling to go up and down the incline, they decided to put a tunnel in. There you go. There's a nice little view for you. Yeah, we came to a standstill there. Uh, running very slow and I presume, and I don't know why it's all working like this, we shall now cross to the fast line and then probably come back uh, to this line after we've overtaken the car train. It all seems a silly way of working, but then again, what the hell do I know? We'll see in a minute if we uh, cross over. There's the peg, or signal if you want the other word. Pity it's not a nice scene, isn't it? I could be wrong. Yeah, crossing over. Why didn't they do that in the first place? Don't know. <laughs> okay, I hope you're not getting bored. I 
find it very interesting myself. We shall now overtake the empty car train in a minute. Well, I'm sorry to say that I've got it wrong. The car train is not here at all. Can't always be right. Right, we've done the faux pas. Um, so excited to see another gentleman and having somebody to talk to. Um, I didn't switch my camera on and I thought I had. So um, there you go, but there he is now. We've had a nice little chat, haven't we, sir? Yes, we have. Yes, yes. yes. And you reside in Bedford? I do live in Bedford, yeah. I grew up in London. Oh, right, okay. And um, when I was sort of 10, 11, 12, I used to visit all the big railway stations to see the engines there. Yeah. Yeah, so, I love London. Yeah. Yeah, I, I watch a lot of videos of uh, people enjoying themselves in London as well. I used to. Yeah. I used to give a talk to my old school. Oh right, okay. Six forms. Yeah. And I used to say I grew up in the sixties. I used to say when, when the sixties started. Almost every locomotive on the railway was steam, and by the end of the 60s, there was a man walking on the moon. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> amazing, yeah, isn't it? yeah. Can Ten I years. ask how old you are? I'm 75. 75, yeah. yeah. I like you got, you still got that little tinge of London accent. Have I? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not every word, but you, you no, just no, pick the, it up. The Bedford accent is, is dying out. It's <laughs> <laughs> you do you do hear people speaking here, but yeah. it's quite rare. It's yeah. lovely to hear. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I love. I, I'm I'm addicted to London and Glasgow. And Gla yeah, yeah, I've got friends who of 60 years who live in Dumbarton. Yeah, I know where Dumbarton. Yeah, four train, miles from Loch Lomond. Trains, trains in Dumbarton. Yeah, I've been up, <laughs> I've been up there 60 times. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah oh, yeah. very good. Well, nice talking to you anyway. We're okay. going up on the um, sleeper to Fort William. Oh, We've yes. Many times. Yes, yes, We're yes. Going back on the day train. Yeah. Glasgow. Yeah. I've, been, to I, I've, I've twice I've been on a four day railway land cruise. Yes. Where you sleep on the train overnight. Oh, wonderful. Beautiful. Love to do it. Oh, I'm going home to go to bed now. It's made me feel tired. Thank you for talking to me anyway. Thank you very much, it's lovely okay. to meet you. <laughs>